Hello, good morning everybody. How are you doing today? This is One Honey Bell. And today we are going to make a T-bone steak. Juicy T-bone steak. And I have all my ingredients here. I have some black pepper, some garlic, and I have my butter. I have a little olive oil. You can use canola oil also. I have my rosemary, fresh rosemary from my tree. And I have some thyme. I'm going to use also coarse salt. So I put my salt on. Not too much, you know, you judge it. And you press it in and rub it all over. Rub it all over, you know. And then you do the other side as well. I'm gonna put my, but I wash my hands. Yes. I'm gonna put my um, black pepper now, and then you put your black pepper like, you know, just. If you, you know, some people is allergic. If you allergic to black pepper, you don't need it. So you rub it in. Rub your black pepper in and your salt. And um, this is really a nice juicy T-bone steak. Yeah. Just rub it in, rub it in, rub it in. You can let this sit for maybe a 10 to 5 minutes. You can put it straight in the pot or you can um, let it sit for 10 minutes or 15 minutes, you know, to soak in. Or you can put it straight in the pot. Whatever you want, depending on how hungry you are. Okay. So as I go on, I'll show you what's going on in my kitchen today. One honey bell. Please subscribe and like to our videos. Thank you. So I'm using a skillet pad to do my steak. My T-bone steak, and I'm drizzling a little olive oil. Yes. So I'm making my T-bone steak now, and I have my skeleton over here, and I drizzle a little olive oil. And now I'm gonna put in my steak. I'm gonna use this spatula because I. If you use a fork, you'll dry your meat out. So I'm using this. I swear to God, I'm so you let it heat a little bit and then you're going to put it in like put it in and I'm going to let it cook for I'm going to let it cook for three, four minutes on one side and four on the other side so as we go on, I'll show you what's going on in my kitchen. Okay. I'm crushing my garlic with this. You can use a knife if you want. But this is easier for me. There's a little smash. That was a little bit too hard. So just a little smash. Oh, God. There we go. And I'm going to put it in. So I put a little bit of butter. Butter give it nice flavor. If you look, you see my rosemary. And I put two pieces. Sorry. And then I put a little thyme. My garlic. Another piece of garlic. And I'm just, as I told you, I'm going to let it brown on both sides. You put your 
heat like medium high so as we go on i show you what's going on in my kitchen yes one hundred bell please like and subscribe to my video a nice juicy steak follow us okay so four minutes is up and I'm gonna turn it over wow, beautiful just beautiful I'll show you as you go on what's going on so this is how it looks and we can take your spoon and put some of the oil on top like this. depends on I want to go medium to well done so I'm just gonna pop it in the oven now for seven minutes so I'll show you what's going on so I'm gonna pop it in the oven for seven minutes that's it I'm gonna set the timer turn off my stove the seven minutes is up and I'm gonna take out my T-bone stick that's how it looks so I'll show you as we go on so it's ready and I'm gonna put it in the plate now wow it's so juicy it looks so pretty wow I love it looks good came out good but we're gonna try a little piece and see how it tastes now how it looks because it's medium well so let's see if we get a little pink so this is how it turns out you get a little pink it's medium to well you know not well done but you see a little pink in there and it's so juicy if you look you see all the juice so good so thanks for watching and subscribe and like to my video. I would appreciate it. I need subscriber. Thank you. And have a pleasant day. God bless. Bye.